Hello and welcome to Prominent Hysterian Era. This is a mod pack on Curse Forge for Minecraft. That's right. What's going on? So, last mod pack, all the mods 9, existed last month. This month we're going to start something new where we got to change stuff up with the scheduling and blah 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 blah. Nobody cares. All that really matters is mod and Minecraft. I don't know about this music, but it's, this is, I don't know, it's quality, dog. It's quality. We're gonna call this save the world of one. Because that's me. I am one guy. There's only one in this world because it's solo. And we don't have any friends. And that's just how that works. Up, up, up. That's my pause button. That's gotta change. You click a button and this map, oh look at them, look at them frames. Oh baby, isn't that so nice? It's spooky. Do you hear the wind? It's spooky. So J-Dog, the game looks kind of choppy. Yeah, a bit, it's running at 13 frames a second. You just gotta let it load. Am I loading 32 frames? I am. This is so last time we played the mod of Minecraft, we learned that you wanna when you start the game, go to your settings, go to your video settings, go to options, right? Go to uh chunks and make sure it's maxed, right? At the very start, just so you can get this this map. You know what I'm saying? Do you hear me? Do you hear that? You can't hear it? I'm rubbing the screen with my fingertips. That's weird. Alright, alright. Look at us, the game is running nice and smooth. Look at this map going. Oh, it's beautiful. It's freaking gorgeous. Now, this is a true Minecraft experience right here. This is exactly what I wanted. You know what month it is right now? It's October. So, October means we're going for a little more spooky. Spooky vibes. Darkness, tribulation. You know what I'm saying? Look. Oh, so I guess we spawned. And we spawned with this sword and a shield and some bread. And a quest book. You know what I'm saying? Time to read. Prominence is a mod pack for everybody. There's a quest book that helps you go through the mod pack. Sometimes it's simple, sometimes it's more complex. The basics. Start your journey in Prominence. The mod pack. First steps. Questing. The quest book is super important. You can open the book via the book or otherwise left side shows you this find a fruit or vegetable to continue on the quest log screw the fruit or vegetable dog is the game too loud what is this is a stick that's a block of gold wait that's an item frame. this is a block of gold dude do you see that stick I got a freaking stick, head. Yellow stained glass. I thought it was a door. Now, there's already some things I like about the mod pack. You hear the crows, the birds, the wind, the footsteps. This game has a lot more, like, ambient noise. The footsteps are really loud, though. Let's fix that. That's better. You got these little niche things you gotta fix. I'm just looting all these barrels. There's a chest right here. It has iron armor. Noise. That's what I like to see. Oh, yeah. Let's just grab everything. I don't need inventory space. Are you kidding me? Who needs inventory space where you're going to have everything? Advancements? Advancements? I'm kidded. Let's go. Dude, check this map out. It's bussing. We already have a guardian temple? That's crazy. Look at this. I guess there's a mountain to my north, and there's some redstone caves. Like, that's crazy, dude. Look at this map, though. What the heck? There's a village over here. You see this house right here? It's like a, it's like in Iceland or Greenland. They build the house, and they put dirt on it. They put dirt on the house. Why do they do it? Uh, it's probably to hide it from air raids, people were assuming. No? Disagree with that statement? I thought it was a good statement. We found some potatoes. 
Normally grows this season. There's seasons. First step completed. Let's go. You hear that horrible noise to my right over there? That's the guardians. They're attacking something. 2 XP. I love XP. Chapters. To open the quest chapter screen, close this quest and move your cursor to the left. We know exactly how to do that. Boom. Quest chapters. So easy. I'm getting free XP, dude. Press M to claim a chunk. I'm J Dog. I claim the chunk. I don't know if I claim the chunk. Chain selected. Yeah, there you go. It's a multiplayer feature, so we don't have to worry about it. How nice. Obtain an anvil to learn about anvil stuff. Leveling. Leveling is all about, so enemy scale with my level. Defeating enemies gives me XP that goes to my level. Some boss fights require a certain level. Oh, yeah, yeah. The talent tree. I love talent trees. The talent tree. You can open it by pressing N and can use a knowledge scroll to reset your level. Whoa! <laughs> what the heck? It's Path of Exile? Ranger, Rogue, Protectors, Frozen, Enigmatic, Pyrotechnic? What the heck? Zero out of 32 talent points. I'm gonna click on something. Nothing. I don't have any talent points. I'm fucking weak. Dude, is this supposed to be a little boat? You see this thing right here? It's supposed to be a little boat. Is boat is a Viking tribe, dude. Unemployed. Dude ain't got no job. He needs to go get a job, bro. What the heck? We found the village's waystone. Bavitusa. Bavitusa. That was one of the quests up here. Do a waystone. Let's go. We get an empty scroll. Nice. Welcome to prominence. We got a music disc. Nice. Oh, my inventory is messed up. So, gear has rarities. And using an anvil and resources, you can upgrade the rarity of gear to make it better. You know what I mean? A spell tone. Mutton. One of the beauties of having this game rendered at 32 chunks is, uh, look at this. You can see the flying islands way across the map. There's one there, there's one there. Oh, wow, there's that? <laughs> I didn't even see it. Yeah, having 32 chunks helps you see things directly above you. You can you can see the god rays. Whoa, look at the shaders. That's crazy. It's nice, but I have to lower the chunkage. It makes the game run terribly. Look. It's the first thing that wants to kill me. What the heck? There's more than one. I'm scared. I'm scared. He's drowned. How does he know how to swim? Wait, I don't have my sword equipped. What the heck? What the heck? There's a whole swinging animation? <laughs> what the heck? My arms, dude. Oh, look at that. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I can shield bash. I can shield it. Oh, boom. I'm the monster hunter. Oh, there's a guardian. I'm scared. Don't kill me, please. It's painful dying. I kill these fools, huh? See that swing? It hit both of them. Oh, I'm cracked. All right, for real though. We're done messing around with these with these fools. This is one heck of a map spawn, dude. It's nothing but ice to my north and nothing but <laughs> water to my south. Where's the equator, bro? What the heck? What's up with this world? This looks insane. Gotta chop some wood with my bare hands. Because I don't have... Excuse me? I broke the bark. Oh, no. Oh no, I need an axe. I gotta chop it eight times? Oh no! What the heck? Look at this site. Look at this. Look at this tree. <laughs> you, can't, you can't see anything, dude. It's so dark. Oh man, is it a ghost? Oh, the whole thing just broke. Ah, beautiful. I needed this wood. 
Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Bro, everything in this looks all messed up. Look at this pickaxe. What the heck even is this, dude? I still can't see nothing. I should have stolen one of those beds. You know what I'm saying? Make it daytime. Jeez. Oh, I learned a new spell. Novice spellcaster. I guess you just take these and you just learn them. Cloud shot, gust. I already learned propel. Oh, no. How do I use my spells? Be like, dragon breath. What's that? Glowberry. Hot sun lichen. Isn't that like a vine? What's lichen? Ah, ah. Okay, I know what it does now. If you step on it, it sets you on fire. Look at this cool little feature. Stuff says in the crafting table, and you have this little icon. Oh, it's so pretty. It even changes its orientation to where you are. Who modded this game? I made a chest to complete a quest. Boom, baby. Excuse me. My inventory, I have three spaces. I got it. That's important, because guess what? There's three rewards. <laughs> Upgradable via the iron chest mods. Standard traveler's backpack. Oh, baby. So I need to make a standard traveler's backpack. Now, to do that, I need a... I need, I need a bed. I don't have a bed. This sucks. But it's daytime. You know what that means? <laughs> I don't have any inventory space. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, it's daytime. Inventory's clean, enough. And now I can mine uh, coal, which means I can make torches. This is why I had to wait till it was daytime. I couldn't even, I can't even see anything, dude. Like, how am I supposed to do stuff when I, I don't know I can't see? I just want you to know I'm absolutely correct. I made a stone pickaxe and it's legendary, legendary stone pickaxe plus two reach. This thing's common. That's why I don't have no damn attack range. Get out of here, piece of crap. This thing's legendary. It's better than an iron pick. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's so fast. Now I got torches. I can see things. Oh, baby. We're insane. I made an epic stone axe. I don't know how this happens, dude. A legendary pickaxe, epic stone axe. You know what luck is? Uh, I don't got no more. I used all of it on stone tools, baby. Who goes mining, dog? Why go mining when you can just find all the stuff you need inside chests? Look at this. I got irons galore. This is a, this is a, I don't know what this is. Looks like it's supposed to be a mine shaft, but it seems to be closed. It's all messed up. Maybe, maybe, maybe if I dig down there, I'll find a real mine shaft. Maybe it, uh, maybe got clogged up. But I got 11 iron. Oh, baby. We just need some, we just need some, uh, some leather. Now, I got some saddles here. Yeah, I can tear him up. That's exactly what I gotta do. Ooh, yeah. So I like to see. Was this an iron nugget? Get that out of here. Now we got four leather. You go like this. Check this out. Wait a moment. I don't remember the crafting recipe at all. Oh, I just clicked it did the thing. Traveler's backpack. We're insane. Put it on my back. Try again. Excuse me, sir. Let's try this. Oh! Oh! Inventory enhancement. I love it. Now I can get rid of all this crap. Oh, look. A book. Oh, look. A bunch of stuff you're never going to use. Oh, it's so beautiful. I had rotten flesh on me. What a waste. What a waste. Sticks. Sticks. What the heck? So we did all this, right? Now we give a blank blank upgrade for the for the thing. Now you combine this with iron or gold or diamonds to make the respective upgrade, right? Lucky for me. I just so happen to have a bunch of iron that I didn't mine. Ah, very good. And then you go, you open the backpack and then you pull it out and then you combine it with this. Nah, 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 that's wrong. That's wrong. Maybe, I don't know. How do you combine it? 
smithing table. Yeah, that's where my second guess was gonna be. Unfortunately, I don't have enough iron to make a smithing table. Oh wait, <laughs> unless <laughs> there's iron right here. How nice. When you're too busy finding stuff like anvils to craft them. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Uh, wait, didn't I get that quest on? Excuse me, sir. I have an anvil. Submit. Oh, mine's chipped. Weak. You can reforge gear! Whoa! Do you hear the pelicans, dude? The seagulls? Damn, they're annoying. We got that 50 raw iron, though? There's only one problem. So we have the iron that we needed. Now, we don't have any, uh... We don't have any leather. We're all out of leather again. Again, can I make can I turn around flesh and leather? Sometimes you can do that. There are multiple ways to do it, but none of them are obtainable. So the answer is no, we cannot easily turn rotten flesh into leather at this current moment in time. Let's wait until uh, until the stuff's done smelting. So this mod pack has its own quest line, its own storyline. Skellax Forge, Boys Invasion, Hesterian Era. It has its own quest line. Just so you're aware, there's lore to it. It's got its own thing. Obviously, we're going to be doing it. S-O-B-O. -O. Now, while we wait, just claim some quests. Look at some stuff. Poseidon has lost all of his fish for his personal aquarium. Help the god of the sea by finding and fishing up some new specimen for the god, and they'll reward you. That sounds cool. Oh, it's like Stardew Valley. That's pretty cool. Captain Cornelia, a great captain who sailed until she fell into the depths of the freezing oceans. One must be daring enough to find her ship and take her treasures away if they can find it. Go underwater in the ocean biomes. I'm being attacked by a ghost. I'm scared. To find the ship of Cornelia and you find the cool stuff like the pirate pouches. Demeter's Garden. Demeter? Is it Demeter or Demeter? I'm being attacked by a spider. Blocked. Oh, I got this axe. It swings nice and slow. I right-clicked on the wrong spot. Oh, that dude's cooked. Plant life scattered across the world and is challenging anyone who is willing to gather them to satisfy the goddess of agriculture and will be rewarded. Get all the Croptopia seeds. Get all of the, the saplings. Get all of the delighted crops. Peace, bro. Screw. He's cooked. Collectibles. Whoa. Welcome, young collector. Get all of the trinkets in the game. Villager fossils. I'm not going to lie. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Um, There's mimics. Kill mimics. Get rewards. You can also find these in chests. I found an antidote vessel in the chest. The reward is just XP. I'll take it. I'll take it. And then I die and lose all of it. Welcome to the thing. You must find the things and collect them for your own benefit. You cannot give each trinket a name. Just refer to them as the thing. Nothing more, nothing less. Oh, yeah. The thing. Find the music discs. Basic Minecraft music discs. Modded music discs. Which I think I already found one. Yeah. Slider nails nine. It takes a diamond to make a jukebox. So we cannot do that. The prison, the nether, the end, the bubble zone, the other side. Then add Astra, all the moons and planets. Information. Each weapon has its own attack animation, combos, hold to attack. Excuse me. Whoa, I can do a reverse swing. That's crazy. Shields, they do stuff. Click to read more. Click. Understand. Chapter completed. Bussin. Reforging. We know something about this. We need an anvil, though. Ah, it's a lot of information. We do it as we get to it. Simply swords mod. You need a runic tablet. What the heck? Souls like weaponry. Dark Souls. I love Dark Souls. We need Soul Sand. You know what? They got me. They said souls like weaponry. You need soul sand. You know what? Those two things just go together. I'm falling. <laughs> I 
Oh, look at that. Oh, we can play this game in third person. I'm, oh, I'm fucking, I'm a god, bro. Jeez. All right, checking out some of these other mods. We got magic tech mods. I don't know why there's so many tech mods. We know a little bit about tech mods. Last time we had tech mods, we were like, oh, tech mods, let's not do that. All right, tech mods are a little bit too much. Magic mods are a lot of, a lot of cool, a lot of fun. We like magic mods. And there's plenty. There's plenty to go around. Oh, baby. Sorcerer's metal. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, witchcraft and rituals. Okay, you'd be like, J-Dog, remember last time occultism? Horrible. This mod uses bewitchment. Bewitchment, I... So this is fabric. Now, we're, we're kind of hitting everything. Different mod loaders affect different mods and mod packs. Because fabric has its own set of mods and forge has its own set of mods. There's two, the fabric and forge. Right now, forge is becoming neo-forge. That's a different thing. Um... This is fabric. Fabric has different mods than Forge does. Last time we did a Forge mod pack, this time we're doing a fabric mod pack. And the reason why I say this and it's why it's super duper important is because there are different mods in each one. So, we have Bewitchment. We don't have Occultism. Alright, Bewitchment's actually cool. Alright. There's a reason why it's actually cool. Oh, he's cooked, brother. Look at the water. Whoa, it looks like real water. What's that? There's a zoom button, right? Yeah, see? Oh, it's fish. <laughs> I didn't know what it was. Do we need more wood? Yeah, we're almost out of wood. I gotta go find some wood. Is it a spider? I like combat. Come here, spider. Let's go learn more about my incredibly slow swing speed. Oh, he's cooked. Oh, Zooey mama. Was this building always here? Did I just skip it? What the heck? Incredible. Coal. Coal and emerald and coal and charcoal. Nah. This is this is why we loot stuff. It's worthwhile. Potato. Oh, a cow. I needed that leather. Thanks, son. Alright, dope. What is this? Hay bale. Hay bale is made of nine wheat. smithing table acquired let's go and then with the smithing table i combine dude did that cow drop any leather oh he didn't drop any leather i killed him i need leather oh my god well there's one cow there should be another right there's not another cow and he didn't drop any leather that sucks the hanging tree now it's called the hanging tree i figured out because that dude right there, that dude is new stop. Oh, that guy still. Nameless hang. Excuse me, sir. Are you evil? That's scary. How about we don't interact with that? That's called imminent demise. I'm not. I've, I've played Minecraft before. I've never seen nothing like that before. What the heck? There's freaking dragons. Let's not mess with that. That's how you die, bro. They're gonna spit fire at me, dude. I'm not ready, dude. All right. The way I'm seeing it, we got two options. We can go north. We go in the ice biome, the frozen tundra. The frozen ocean, the hyacinth depths. I'm assuming this is a water biome. That looks crazy. What's that? There's a freaking orb. What is this? What's going on? Or oh, we can go south to this taiga biome down here. Forest, taiga, birch, you know what I'm saying? Now, I might, I'm probably going to go south. Like, I love the cold. I love the ice. I love the snow. The white is beautiful. It's gorgeous. But man, I don't know what's going on. So we're making a boat. Ah, there's also this location over here. Interesting. Now I can only hope that some Charybdis or some freaking Scylla or some water dragon don't come out the water and just kill me instantly. You know what I mean? Like, look how scary this looks. Being alone at sea where the only thing you can see is a flying island over there. What the heck? Dude, I go to the flying island. I feel like that's how people die. You know what I mean? That does not look like something I want to do right now. Land ho! I finally killed that cow, dude. I finally got that freaking leather, dude. Let's go. Iron backpack. Iron backpack. 
extra bar. That's a great opportunity to shove more crap in there. Excuse me, Shadow Sting? A chance on hit to deal magic damage that scales with your target's armor belly creates a blinding shadowy mist at your feet and shadow step sword for, for a while. Hold left to view gem slide. What the heck is this thing, bro? You know, come to think of it, I need some wool as well. Wool is a useful material. From the shadows. Oh! <laughs> What's the animation look like for it? Oh, I stab. Nice. It looks so cool. You remember that thing? It said prison. Remember that? Over here it said the prison. I found it. The portal of the prison dimension spawns randomly throughout the overworld. If you have at any point been in possession of diamond, the portal will have already been activated. Well, it ain't already activated. I can tell you that much. There's a fucking tree in the middle of it. There's, I found the prison. I found it. I'm not going in there. I'll mark it on the map. Create the waypoint. The... Prison. Confirm. There you go. Now we know where it's at, but uh, I don't trust myself, dog. What is this? Mind Cells Guidebook. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Hey, give me that. Mm hmm. That makes sense. Alright, so I've been exploring for a small duration of time. Uh, for a long duration of time, actually. Now that I think about it, I've been out here for a while. So, I. I. I the first thing we do when we play Minecraft is we spend the first seven episodes finding the right place to settle down. That's the way to do it, right? That's how you're supposed to do it. That's how they intended it to do it. You just travel the world, find the nice places and stuff. That's what they want you to do. So, that's what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to find that nice spot. You know what I mean? And uh, we're not making the base up here at this massive frozen peak. I saw it and I was like, yo, we got to go up. There's a freaking house here? Is it a door? Who lives here? No, that's not a door. It's <laughs> an emerald ore. That's not a door. That's an emerald ore. What the heck? Is that a sheep? What the heck? I'm scared. I'm very scared. Where's my shield? It's a goat. Goat would have been my second guess. Somebody lives up here? So I'll come up here. Just to, like, end the episode, you know. Yeah, we don't know where we're going. Next episode's gonna be a lot of the same. A lot of, a lot of we gotta find out what's going on over here, over there, what's going on in that direction. You know, we gotta learn. We gotta get learned. I wanna see the whole map. Why isn't the whole map just already loaded? So I can just pick a spot. Jeez, man. All right. Freaking goat. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.